Hi, this is Tori Witt with the Oracle Technology Network. We're here live at the floor of Java One. You can tell with all the noise going on behind us, it's getting more and more exciting as the day goes on. Um, and I've got Stuart Marks. Stuart, hey. delight to have you here. Explain to me the lab coat. <laughs> I'm a little confused. Okay, so this is my Dr. Deprecator persona. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I need a little more than that. All right, so uh, the Java platform has had a, uh, I should say, thanks for having me here, Tori. Oh, it's a delight <laughs> yeah. that you're here. Okay, so so the Java platform has had this notion of deprecation for a very long time. It was introduced way back in GDK 1.1 in 1997 or so, I think okay. that's when it was. And so a bunch of things have been deprecated over the years, but it's kind of, it's kind of confusing and disorganized. Oh. And so... My emphasis is that there needs to be some effort put into this to get that back under control. Uh, I think it's a good concept, it just hasn't been executed very well. Okay, um, so things have been deprecated, but they're still floating around and they're still functional. They're, they're right? still, and some people places, are still very dependent on them, right? Still, yeah, there's, there's a lot of things that have been deprecated that people are still depending on, but there have been a lot of things that have been deprecated for completely different reasons. Mm, and so, okay. so, the, the meaning of deprecation has been diluted. Ah, okay. Bastardized, if you will. I suppose so. Okay, I and, can use that one. Yeah. <laughs> this is a family show. Yeah, it's, yeah. <laughs> it's still early. Okay. So, so all right. So you you are going to single-handedly do this. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have some ideas. I think we need to we need to we need to create some better organization around what it means to for something to be deprecated. Because um, okay. there are a bunch of different reasons you need to. You know, pick them all apart a little bit. Makes, okay. Make, make things make more sense. And uh, I think there's this notion that if something is deprecated, it's going to be removed at a certain point. And um, that's that's true in some cases, but in fact, nothing has actually ever been removed Whoa. from the Java platform. No APIs. Ruh -ruh. No deprecated APIs have actually ever been removed. Ah. And to, to a certain extent, that's a good thing because I like to say that that removing something is the ultimate binary incompatibility. It's the ultimate source incompatibility. Too. Yes, true. So that's that's why we're very reluctant to to actually remove things. Uh, at the same time, having something deprecated, saying we're going to remove it and then never removing it, it just it's essentially a very yeah. dissonant position. To yeah, be that's in. kind of a mixed message, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So, so you see, there's there's some some things. Some dynamic yeah, tension I'm sensing exactly, here. Exactly. But if you want to move forward, you gotta. You know, sometimes you have to throw a few things off the chip, right. right? So there's some things that really do need to be removed, and we okay. have some ideas for some stuff that actually, some APIs that actually will be removed in JDK 9. Bum, uh, bum, bum. That's, that's right. Yeah, this is this is public. This is a sort of pre-announcement. It's actually an open JDK. Okay. Some of the early modularization work actually removed some APIs in order to break dependencies across modules. So, ah, so that was okay. necessary because if you want to... You know, an API dependency is almost impossible to, to I mean, the only way to, to break it is to remove it. Right, 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 right. I mean, the only way, I mean, and you, in order to separate modules, you need, you need to have your dependencies under control. Okay. So that's really a jigsaw thing. Ah, um, okay. So to en enable modularization, there's some things that uh, Oracle or the Java community really needs to take out. Yeah. Right. And so, if you go, if you, and if you go look at Open JDK, they've been taken out already. Ah. In okay. JDK nine. So if you get JDK nine, the current development builds, that stuff has been taken out. Already. So what's the best way for a developer to get a sense of what these bad boys are going to be, or how to get involved and go? No, no, you absolutely <laughs> can't destroy this. Well, all this stuff is in the open, but there's a tremendous amount of information about Open JDK. Okay. Um, so I think. How do you? Uh, how would you find out about this stuff? I know that there are. Well, one is we do have the uh, the preview builds, right? So okay. Earlier this year, we shipped GDK eight, right? And so we immediately, uh, pretty pretty close to immediately. In fact, even before JDK eight shipped, we started opening the uh, source repositories for JDK nine, and we've been doing builds from those and, and pushing them out pretty regularly. Okay, so you should grab those early builds, yeah. run your apps, and see. Right. Or even, even, yeah, even try to compile. Oh, okay. Um, and then there, yeah, so it's the same thing. Uh, the builds, I mean, we have binaries out there. The source is, of course, in the repository. Also, complete Java doc sets. Right. 
Right. Um, and, you know, the thing is, I don't know if there's any really good place you can go that says, we have removed these APIs. I don't know if there's a release notes yet for that. Okay. And so that might be a difficulty. Um, it's, it's kind of obscure stuff. It's like dependencies of Java beans on AWT. If you think about it, beans is sort of a, you know, it's a component architecture. So why does it have a dependency on this user interface library? Right, right, so, right. So it's those kind of things There was where, a good reason at the time. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Well, maybe there was Well, if you of the system <laughs> as, as one big monolithic a uh, big ball of mud, right. then it doesn't matter where the dependencies are. You try to modularize it, then what happens is you get these dependencies, okay, we we'll, we'll put, we'll put the client stuff in one module, we'll put beans in a different module, and, right. you know, so, right. so there are these dependencies going across. That's one that comes to mind. They're all of that flavor where if you look at it, it's like, oh yeah, that is a very odd dependency. And so they are kind of on the, the obscure side, but if your application uses them, you'll get compilation errors because uh, yeah. Yeah, if, you, if you recompile, because you know, those APIs are done. Right, right. Okay. So I see your uh, Twitter handle is down here, Dr. That's Deprecator. Right. So, Dr. Deprecator. So that's a great way to get information, <laughs> right, is to follow your Twitter handle and yeah. maybe yeah. DM well, you. As, and as, as is typical on Twitter, there's it's mostly snark and uh, clever Yeah, uh, clever Yeah, slogans. he's pretty clever. I'm, I enjoy <laughs> watching that. But... That so, you would be a good person to talk to yes. in terms of getting more information about this, right? Yes, I think so. I could, I could uh, certainly find that information out and forward it to anybody. Who's and certainly, if a developer has a you know a hankering to help you out with this, right? To join the community and yeah. help clean out some of these weird dependencies, uh, so Java can move forward certainly with Jigsaw and get that modularization, which will allow a lot of good things to happen. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Um, you would be a good person to talk to. Yeah, I think mainly overall, it's this idea that the, the there's, I think there's a lot of so that so I'm giving a talk on this on uh, Wednesday. Okay, here we go. So talk club, yeah. ready? Okay, yeah. Drum so, go. Uh, con six three seven seven, debt and deprecation, and in my mind, that's what Doctor Deprecator is all about. Debt as in technical debt. Right. And so right. if you if you look at this, right, we were talking earlier about this idea of deprecation and. We say we're going to do something and we never do, and stuff hangs right. around. It's kind of confusing. This time we really mean it. Well, maybe <laughs> for some things. I think what we need to do is is is, is normalize things and make things congruent, right? Like, so if we're going to take something out, we should say so and then take it out and have but a the, consistent process. Right. But there it. there are some things where you know it's deprecated, but we actually don't intend to take take it out. Okay. So we should say that too. Ah, okay. So. Uh, and, and the fact that this is unclear, people are confused, things are mismarked, that's a form of technical debt. Right? There's uh, messiness in our API right, right. that needs to be cleaned up. So that's what Dr. Deprecator is all about. And so, so Wednesday, 3 o'clock, right. it's in the Yosemite, Yosemite A. Yep. Is that where it is? Yeah, Yosemite A. Okay. All right, you can hear me talk about that in more depth. Yeah, and I, I hope that that's going to be captured. So that I think so. Know. I've okay. heard that every... Uh, Yes. Every talk at the conference is going to be recorded. And we'll so. give you more information okay. about that soon. But thank you, Stuart. All right. If you're here Thanks at Java Stuart. One, come to the hub. Okay. Stuart will be here, the good looking man oh. in the lab coat. <laughs> yeah, look got, for the lab coat. Yeah, yeah I, no, I don't know if he's going to go up to a CPU no. with that or. No, no, no. no. no it's just all this is actually a real stethoscope, <laughs> although it's not clear I know how to use it in, in anger. <laughs> Could recognize me by my uh, Doctor Deprecator name badge. Right excellent, there. excellent, so good. Look for me uh, around the hub or uh, on the you know the conference rooms. We're I'll on be uh, Java, Java One all week. Great, thank you very much for all dropping right, by. Lot, it's good to talk to you. This is Tori Wheel with the Oracle Technology Network.